The OptiClean features a simple setup procedure that will quickly get your unit working and easily mobile. Before removing the shipping straps, slowly lower the unit so that it is resting on its back. Use two people to lower if necessary. The front of the unit will be indicated by the exposed logo and should be facing up. Cut and remove the straps from the packaging. Then remove the cardboard coverings and wooden skid. Leave the cardboard cover that the unit is currently laying on. This will protect the unit from scratches during the setup process. Now that the unit is exposed, remove the screws from the bottom front door, followed by the top door. Carefully lift these doors off of the unit. These pieces will have wiring attached to the inside components, so carefully rotate the doors and stand beside the unit as to not put stress on the wiring. With the internals exposed, inspect the HEPA filter and make sure it has not been dislodged or damaged during shipping. This includes checking the side bolts and nuts near each corner to make sure they are tight and the filter is secure. Also, check that the seal around the top edge of the filter is in place. After inspection, remove the flat piece of cardboard from the unit that is protecting the pre-filter. Inspect that the pre-filter is in place and not damaged. At the bottom of the unit, there is a cardboard box with parts. Carefully remove that box now. You may need to tilt the box to get it clear of the unit. With the inspection complete and part box removed, replace the top door over the blower, and then replace the bottom front door, securing in place with the same screws you removed earlier. In the part box, there are two casters and one duct transition. Remove the casters for installation on the unit. On the bottom of the unit, Remove and retain the screws from the front and outer corners of the cabinet bottom. The front casters will use four screws, two on the front of the unit and two on the side. Use the screws that were just removed to secure the front casters. Repeat these steps for the back casters. The only difference being that this set of casters will only be using two screws, one on each side of the unit. With the casters now secure to the unit, place the wheels in the locked position. With the wheels locked, carefully tilt and lift the unit into its upright position. Remove the duct transition piece and bag of screws from the parts box. Place the transition onto the top of the unit. The transition piece has pre-drilled holes to use as guides. Using the included bag of self-tapping screws, Secure the transition piece to the unit. Apply pressure to the opposite side of the unit when drilling into the transition piece. This will assist with securing the transition piece when using the self-tapping screws. The setup of the OptiClean unit is now complete, and it can be placed into its final position. Unlock the wheels and easily roll the unit to its desired location. Plug the unit into a standard 115-volt grounded power outlet. To turn on the unit, flip the green switch on the front. To adjust the speed of the fan blower, use the dial to the right of the power switch. The OptiClean unit is now fully operational. Remember that the pre-filter should generally be replaced every 60 to 90 days, and the HEPA filter is rated for 40,000 hours of operation, or four years, under normal conditions and with recommended replacements of the pre-filter. If you have any questions, please consult the included operation and maintenance manual.